Hello everyone, my name is Larissa and today I'm going to react to the new Lion King trailer, like the official trailer. So I'm very excited for this. Yesterday I uploaded my Q&A video and um, I got some people pointing out that the new Lion King trailer came online. And I also reacted to the last one. So that's what I'm going to do and I'm so excited. Like we already had a trailer but this is like the official, official trailer. Like the trailer trailer. So I'm very excited. I hope we're going to... Um, see more than last time more characters maybe because last time we basically saw Simba and some we basically saw those famous Lion King moments and we saw how they like recreated them but we didn't really see the characters so yeah I hope we will see that now and then I'm going to react to this so let's go life's not fair is it, my little friend? Aww. While some are born to feast, they're so cute. Their lives in the dark. This is cool. Begging for scraps. Oh my fucking god! Everything you see exists together in a delicate balance. While others search for what they can take, a true king searches for what he can give. Run away. <laughs> Don't do this. Don't do this. And never return. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm crying so hard at a trailer that's like not even two minutes long. <laughs> but it was so good, what the heck? I don't think I've ever seen a trailer that good. Well, I don't know if it's a trailer or just because we all know, already know The Lion King and now we're seeing it in a real life action. You know, the thing is, I always have to cry when, when Mufasa dies. I had to cry when Mufasa died from the moment I saw it the first time when I was just a little kid. Every time I rewatch The Lion King, I'm just in tears. I don't know what it is. Maybe it... I mean, lots of people will share this feeling with me. But it could also be because when I was young, I experienced it so heavy that I'm still experiencing it the same. I don't know if that, that could be the reason. But I just can't watch that without crying. And even in the trailer, we just got this really little little part. And we saw Simba running away with the... How do you... I don't know how you uh, call those beasts in English. Oh, you also call them Gnu in English. Okay. Um, you saw them running away from them. And I just immediately knew what was up. And I was like, no, no, fuck the shit. I'm out. And I just instantly started to cry. Oh, it's so beautiful. It's so fucking beautiful. I can't believe we're getting this blessing. Oh, uh, seeing all those characters and the Lion King music is also something that just really touches me. I've been to the musical two times and I just couldn't watch the musical without crying the entire time. You must think I always cry, but um, <laughs> that's also not true. But with the Lion King, it is. <laughs> and uh, when you saw Scar, Scar is so, oh, that's so amazing. Even though I, I did kind of hope he would have the black manes because that makes him more like the bad guy, I think. But still, it's so cool just that I am... It's like he's Mufasa, but less pretty, I guess. Uh, I love Scar, though. Oh, yeah. I mean, I hate him in the movie. I hate him for killing Mufasa, but the character is so good. And just to see Simba and Nala together. Oh my god, my heart. And Timon and Pumbaa! 
Actually, my cats are called Timon and Simba. I don't have a Pumba, but uh, I do have a Timon and Simba. So I guess that already expresses my love for the Lion King. Uh, I named my cats after it. Oh, this was just amazing. I can say a thousand things about this. But just the part where he runs away from the gnus. I'm going to cry so hard. Like, I really want to see the movie. But I know I'm just going to cry the entire time. Just like the musical. Just like the normal film. It's just something I can't do without crying. But it's just... its I already see that it is so beautiful. I think in the last trailer we didn't really... Um, see that like we saw things but not on this way now we're really seeing them running we see the landscapes we see the different animals and that's just beautiful i really love it they made that so amazing and especially that music in the end it just breaks me it breaks me <laughs> fucking lion king i wish i could do a reaction video in the cinemas oh that would be so uh, you would only see me cry basically don't know if that's fun to watch only watching me cry for one and a half hours but it would basically be that i think it's just like dumbo actually i haven't seen dumbo yet um and i don't think i will like constantly cry at dumbo but i just have this weakness for animals and their their parents who they get taken away from <laughs> But it's just, I think it has something to do with animals. I just have a real big weakness for animals because they're just so cute and I love them. And I can't handle it when they're in pain. <laughs> I think that's it. I still want to see Dumbo though, but I'm just like the Lion King. I'm just afraid to go because I'm afraid I will have to cry too much. Even though I know that the Lion King will be much worse than Dumbo. I'm go Because the Lion King is just something really close to me. Uh, I've watched it since I was a little kid. Even when I was born, I had this like a uh, bird plate in my uh, front yard and it was just a huge Simba and my name was on it. So my parents just already knew I was going to be a huge Lion King fan. They knew it from the day I was born. I mean, I just always had something with the Lion King and I don't know what it is, but I don't know. It's just something very close to me. and. I can't wait for this movie to come out, even though I know it's going to be a fucking disaster. Me watching that, yeah, that's going to be awful. Actually, right now, first I thought I was going with friends, but right now I'm really, I really have the feeling that I want to go with my mom. I don't know why, I think because we went to the musical two times together, and we basically always watched The Lion King together, and now I'm just feeling like... I have to see this with my mom. <laughs> so after this, I'm going downstairs and I'm just going to say, can we go to the Lion King together, please? I need that. <laughs> oh, guys, this is so good. This is so good. I've reacted to a lot of trailers. And I mean, apart from Game of Thrones trailers, because we all know Game of Thrones is my biggest weakness ever. Um, I think this was like one of the best trailers I ever reacted to. I can't wait till it comes out. It comes comes out on, uh, what was it? The 19th of July. So yeah, we just have to wait until then. It's not that long. I mean, every time when, when there's something coming out, you're like, oh my God, that's so long. And then before you know it, it's already time. I mean, Game of Thrones, yeah. For now, I think this was my reaction. I can say so many things about this. I can just recap this entire trailer with you guys, but I also gotta leave in 15 minutes because I have singing lessons. But for now, I just, I loved it and let me know in the comments what you thought. I mean, I think that the weirdest generation, this generation that's like the closest to the Lion King, like you have those younger children and they're more of the, they're more like the Frozen generation. And I'm a big Frozen fan as well. I really had that period that I was only wearing Frozen shirts and talking about it all the time, even though I was already like 16 years old back then. I just really loved it. But I think we're really this, this Lion King generation. And that of course, I think we're just going to see more um, people from like my age and older than actually really young children. Of course, they're going there as well, but you know what I mean? Like, this is actually something from our childhood. And it's something you always kind of kept with you. I mean, I did. And it, it's just, it just really touches me. And I'm so excited for this. Anyway, I really hope you liked my reaction. Let me know what you thought of it. Let me know how amazing you thought it was. Or if you hated it. How can you hate this? No, you can't hate this. Just let me know how awesome you thought it was. <laughs> no, just kidding. If you like this, please leave a like, subscribe, and I really hope to see you next week at my Game of Thrones reactions. Bye!